And that ball's drilled out towards right center field. Friedel on the move. Jumps. He can't make the play. Horner racing to second and a good job by Myers to grab it. And Nico Horner jumped all over that one. This is his uh, second hit. Top of the order for the Cubs arrive here. Soft line in center field. First hit for the Cubs. And Horner with a base hit. Nico has never had a walk-off hit. Madrigal the winning run. to score two Nico into second it's a two run double corner with a man at third and one away line drive and that's a base hit out into left field Nico Horner delivers three nothing Cubs and therein lies the value of magical getting to third corner who's having a big afternoon two for three that's drilled left field Nico puts a charge into one Not a big part of Nico's game. That is home run number one for him this year. And we talked about the consistent walk. It'll bring up Nico Horner. Horner drives that one out towards left center field. That one back. Gone. Nico Horner. He homered yesterday. He homers today. Into the bleachers. And the Cubs right back in it. It's 6-4. Nico the guy oh six games against the Dodgers 10 hits two home runs the 10th inning leading three to two there's a lot of real estate on the right side of the infield for Nico Horner say it goes base hit into center field we're tied Nico Horner delivered it brings up Nico Horner Horner hits a liner into right field coming in that's going to be a base hit it's bobbled out there by Fraley a run will score as Gomes comes in Cubs lead two to one clutch Opposite field RBI single for Nico Horner. It's in business second and third. 1 0 to Nico. Line drive, and that is a base hit into left field. Gomes in to score. Magical running through a stop sign. And he is going to end up being out. Or chance for Nico Horner to extend his on base streak. Nico Horner with the bags loaded to one. going to score at least two. Velasquez on his horse. It's going to clear the bases. Nico Horner into third. And it's a three-run triple. And the Cubs have broken it open. Six-nothing. And Nico's been on base 20 straight games. Ian in this series. Horner. There's a ground ball into right field. Base set for Nico Horner. Heading home as Mancini. He'll score the tying run. Nico Horner. Horner. And there's still nobody out. Line drive, curling, and a fair ball into the corner. Morell's going to score. Here comes Madrigal around third. Nico will stop at second. It's a two-run double, and it's now 4-1. Native's getting a little restless here in Philly. Nico Horner hits it in the corner. Top of the order is due up for the Cubs. Line drive, rip, right field, Castellanos over his head. Morell around third, and he's in to score. They're sending Madrigal. No throw to the plate, and it is 8-1. And Nico Horner back and making his presence felt. Yeah, that'll go. The bottom of the sixth inning. Horner is over two with a walk. <laughs> Drill left field. This one back. Nico says win, love win. The old solo homer. The folks out there in left. And Nico Horner has grabbed a bat. First pitch. Ground ball base hit up the middle. One run is in. Half around third. He will score. Two run single. Nico Horner. Cubs lead two to one. Boy, I just love. See, that's the pinch hitting model in what the theory is when you come off the bench. Ian for Chicago. Nico Horner, the leadoff batter for the Cubs. Line drive. Base hit right field. Hap comes in to score. Horner wasting no time. It's six. Ooh. Here's Nico Horner. In the air right field. That's well struck. That one back. And that's gone. Oh, boy. The other way. 
over the 21 foot high wall in right. Nico Horner, an opposite field home run, his fifth. The Cubs' best hitter in this moment, right. Nico Horner. Up the middle and base hit. Horner with the knock. One run is in. Here comes Madrigal. And Nico delivers. Cubs lead it 2 nothing. The red hot Nico Horner. He has the ability to stay inside the baseball and drive it up the middle. And without the shift. Trying to walk it off against the Cubs on the 4th of July. Line drive, base hit to left field. Rounding third, heading home, Monasterio. The throw by Hap. It's a good throw. He's going to be out at the plate. The throw to second base and out there. Unbelievable double play. And the Horner will get a chance with two down. With Bellinger 90 feet away. On the ground up the middle. Horner knocks in the go-ahead run. Nico. And it's 7-6 here in the 11th. They're at first and third with two away. And back to the top of the order for Nico Horner. Ground ball through in a right field for a base hit. Coming in to score is Mancini. And the Cubs extend the lead. Two to nothing now over the Yankees. Uh, Rodon frustrated, but Horner, I mean, that's just playing baseball right there. Right side's open, stays inside, and just, oh, you can tell, the whole way back. You see Rodon not happy with the location, knowing his approach. Good for the Cubs, their top RBI man, Nico Horner, due up. Here it is. In the air, out to left field, that one back. Slam! Nico Horner with the bases full. And the Cubs break it open here in the eighth. Yeah, for the second nine year old, Cubs tormenting this Nationals bullpen. And how sweet is that? Bring up the cleanup man, Cody Bellinger. In the air, softly hit. Cole lost the catch. Nico's coming. Here's the throw to the plate. And save! Oh, baby! What a slide by Nico Horner. Challenge this one. Watch the left hand. And he just slid by. Very close. And I can see why Yaz thought he had it. Yeah. The call on the field is confirmed. The runner is safe. The White Sox. Cubs 5 to 1. Nico Horner puts a charge into that one. Left field. Nico having a night. Offense, defense showing the power right there. And for Horner, the home run. Well, after a, a pretty long uh, stretch where he was scuffling, he has really turned it off. Step to the box. Pitch to Nico. And that's ball four. He's walked in another. And the Cubs have the lead. Donovan digs in. Two on, nobody out. Ground ball right side. Horner to second for one. Return to first. Two. And they're an out away from closing it out. Exactly what he needed. And their two best defenders turn the 4-6-3.